Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. But before we start, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon. Thanks. So, renowned author Angela Levin has offered her sharp-tongued assessment of the situation, painting a picture that's anything but rosy. According to Levin, Meghan's approach is far from conciliatory. Instead, she seems to harbor a desire to be acknowledged for herself, while simultaneously wishing for past events to be swept under the rug. Levin has pointed out that Meghan's interest in working positively with the royal family is minimal, if it exists at all. The former suit star appears to have her own agenda, one that diverges from the path of reconciliation. In fact, it's been boldly claimed that when it comes to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, there's a sentiment that nobody wants their involvement. This perspective holds true, even if the royal couple were to return to the UK in an attempt to mend bridges with King Charles. The frosty relations between the Sussexes and the royal family seem to have created a divide that might be insurmountable. Despite the rumors suggesting a possible return, it's clear that their help might not be as welcome as one might expect. Angela Levin's viewpoint delves even deeper into the psyche of Prince Harry. She questions the trustworthiness of his intentions, hinting at the concern that his words and actions could be exploited for financial gain. In a world where deals with major players like Netflix have already been struck, it's a valid concern that the motives behind any move might be financially motivated rather than driven by a genuine desire for reconciliation. As Prince Harry contemplates his return to the UK, the question arises, will he journey alone without Meghan by his side? There are murmurs that Harry might choose this moment to engage in a heart-to-heart -heart with his father, King Charles. The King's return from holidaying in Balmoral could potentially coincide with Harry's stopover, providing a rare opportunity for the father and son to clear the air. So what do you think about this news, guys? Thank you for tuning in to today's discussion. As always, I encourage you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Stay tuned for more updates on the intriguing world of royalty. Until then, thanks for watching. We'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Thank you.